Hi guys, Jimmy here and welcome back to another video. Now today we're going to be looking at a game that really shaped my interest in racing and uh, had a very positive effect on my childhood as a whole. This is Toko Touring Cars as I'm sure all of you know already by that awesome menu screen and the fantastic <laughs> sound effects in the menu. This game was released, and I have to look this up, in November 1997. So this game has just turned 18 years old, which means it's legally okay to drive over here and get married if it wants to without permission from its parents. Uh, so sorry, Cody's going to have to let this one go. But yeah, it's it's so odd coming back to this. I've, I woke up this morning, and opposite my bed there's a shelf for the games on, and I saw this game on the shelf took a touring car championship and I was like wow okay why well, haven't made a video on this yet because I love this game it's fun and it's well, it was classed as a sim back in the day shall we say I've actually got the Wikipedia page up now and under the reception tab uh, this the, there are quotes there saying that, you know the, the graphics for this game are fast detailed liberally peppered with neat, uh, liberally peppered with neat effects that was difficult to say and the sound is among the best to grace a racing sim no not the word sim there so we're gonna give it a go we're gonna give a go of this sim uh 18 years on uh we are not going to qualify because we suck at qualifying and we're gonna be doing a five that brace around uh around donington need to very quickly name my driver with a, an appropriate name i think this will make me win the race definitely and we're going to pick the uh we'll pick the four because it's uh you know it's mundo it's a V6, of course, and we have a V6 in IRL, so uh, I need to pick it, don't I, really? Sort of a b <laughs> obligatory choice. We're going to race at Donington because uh, it's a, the race that I always raced at in the championship before quitting, <laughs> rage quitting at Ricard Rydell at Silverstone. Oh, I've got so many memories of being like literally in tears about Ricard Rydell hitting me off the track in Silverstone. Excuse me, hammering the background. My family think that obviously as soon as I start to uh, make a video, it's the best time doing sort of DIY. But here we are on the grid. Um, revving, revving the V6. Listen to it. Sounds great. We'll go on board. Glorious on board graphics. Uh, I know many steering wheels that look like that in real life, but it doesn't matter. I'm not going to judge it too much with the graphics. It's an old game, does it? We get a bad start, as expected. Uh, obviously, heading at the back of the field due to our fantastic qualification, which we didn't do. And we're going to try hang it around the outside of this Peugeot here. We're getting up behind Derek Warwick. I remember he was in the uh, the white the white Vectra past Talons, the angry Scott. Excuse me, Derek. This is for Ian. Ah! <laughs> that's what you get. Oh, that was brilliant. Oh, god damn it. I hit the, uh, the back button there. I was trying to keep myself steady so much. That's something I love about this game, is you can always pit someone if you really, you really committed to the pit, you could turn someone around, which is nice. But I'm using digital controls, so it's actually really difficult to get the car turned in when you want it to get turned in. The backs of these cars are very... They sort of have a life of their own, so every corner you go into, you're sort of trying not to spin. And uh, these cars don't have traction control, but when you're spinning, you can't hit the throttle. It's not like, uh, you know, you can't spin the wheels when you're spinning sort of thing. So they just sort of go dead. So if you do end up in a situation where that happens, you end up having a very bad time as I'm going to choose to just cut the chicane because that's the best line through there. We stay ahead of the Peugeot. Chasing our teammate now. This is for 10th place. Pretty sure it was top 10 score points in BTCC back, back in these days. I don't remember. Oh, God. Car refusing to go around that corner. Okay, that's a good start, Jimmy. It's one of the uh, Primeras goes past us. Well, that sucks. Okay, yeah, th these things have a very odd sort of braking, turning, accelerating mechanism. Um, so you brake, and now accelerating. And the car does better that way. Um, it's very odd. It's not, it's not really an in-between. It's, it's very sort of indicative of the uh, digital controls, I guess. But, but it has me back racing the way I used to race. When I used to have a game pal, I used to have this sort of... I'm sure you, everyone did this. I used to... Uh, I'd have the tip of my thumb resting on the square button sort of a break and then the uh, the base of my thumb would race on the uh, would rest sorry on the X button to accelerate so all right, let's break early turn it in oh I can't always want to spin there always whatever you do always wants to go to the inside it's very scary but we're still on the track which is good so yeah I'll do that and after you know a couple of hours of driving as you do when you're when you're a wee lad uh, you'd have the most humongous blister <laughs> on your thumb but it was awesome it was good times 
It's really quite nice coming back to play this. I've got so many memories of this game. My, I think my most prominent memory is um, driving at Silverstone in the uh, in the wet and trying to overtake Ricard Rydell so I can progress in the championship, and him spinning me off and me being in tears. I was, I was, I was, you know, seven, six, seven years old. I wasn't a very uh, uh, a bit, of a bit of a pathetic child, <laughs> so um, I also went down to my mum crying, trying to explain that Ricard Rydell was bullying me in the game, and obviously she's like, "What are you talking about?" <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know what's going on? Oh, this hand's showing me the way through there. You know what we think of that? <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Absolute champion. Come on, turn, 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 turn. Good, good. It's sort of. You have to wait for the steering to go. Okay, it's a hairpin. I'll turn now. Oh, fastest lap is that of anyone? I guess it's that of us because we're not catching anyone. So, it's our fastest lap. Come on, nice and easy, nice and easy, nice and easy, easy, easy. Well, I'm not sure we'll be able to catch the guys in front. This is on the medium difficulty as well, so obviously, uh, punching a bit above my weight here. As we shoot down again, oh, this corner's going to give me a hard time, isn't it? Oh, 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 we made it through. Nice. <laughs> but we're five seconds behind the car in front of us. That's a good, that's a good margin. We'll see if we can catch them. We'll see. We'll, we'll do our best. We haven't made any massive mistakes yet, I say, as I make a massive mistake. So we should be all right to catch them eventually. Maybe we'll have to put in some, uh, some swag bent strats. Let's see if we can, uh, Let's see if we can catch up. We're being caught by the Nissan behind us. We're being caught hand over fist. When they get on the straight, we just sort of piss off. So, right, okay. Are you ready? I'm not ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, the strats. Look at that. That is arguably the best line through there. As we come up behind one of the Peugeots. Excuse me. Off he goes. Oh, he's still there. Where is he? I can't see. Oh, there he is. That's, you don't have a look left, look right in these games. You have a turn left, turn right. And if you hear that, someone's there. Why don't you turn? Yeah, because the turning is sort of delayed, you have to wait, for lack of a better word, until the car wants to turn. And then you sort of finally get into the corner. It's a very unique way of driving, I must say. So we're on our fourth lap now. We're still... Going, we might be, might be possible to get top ten if we do some more cheating. I mean, um, swag strats. So, we'll see what we can do. Although well, Peugeot behind us, our teammate in front of us. Is that an Audi in front of him? I can't see. Is it an Audi or a, a Volvo? It's, it's not rendered. I can't really see it. Okay, easy. Easy now. Easy now. Oh! Made it through there. Just about. Again, shooting up the hill. We, we are catching. We're catching our teammate. Team orders. <laughs> I forgot that was there. Get out the way. Get out. Get out. Get out! Tenth place, motherfucker! Oh, by the way, there's probably going to be swearing in this video. As is, <laughs> as, is, as in every video. I think we got a chance of catching our teammate, definitely. Are we going to do the, stra the swag straps or are we going to be honourable? We'll break at the 100 metre board! Almost, almost made it through. That was almost legal. Oh, but the run! Team orders! The run is real. Go down to the heaven again. That's a Volvo in front. Just about making the corner as our teammate decides he's going around the outside. What's that all about? <laughs> Screw you, teammate. Oh, he's going. <laughs> Off he goes. See you later, mate. He's still there. Come on to our final lap now. And we're going to try and chase this Volvo for 8th. Come on, Ford! You look up the inside at turn 1. Can you make it stick? Brush him onto the grass. We're through, but the lap isn't done yet. I've still got to get through this feckin' annoying corner that I forget the name of. It's only annoying in this game. I love it in other games, but not in this one. Oh, God, Carl! I'm going to slide now. Nice and easy, nice and easy, nice and easy. There you go. Looking backwards because mashing the left and right button so much. 10 seconds to the next Volvo. We aren't going to catch him. Got to try and head off this one. As we sort of lazy in the sixth gear. Really should be using the manual, but 
automatic for the win, right? Oh, give me fifth gear, please. <laughs> okay. Focus, Jimmy. This is for eighth place. This would be a good result for this car in real life. The the four wasn't a good car in 1997, which is when this game is based. I was gonna come to line. Swag, 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 swag. God, the list came out in four send, didn't it? Come on. We are going to catch him. We haven't got... We haven't got the ability. We don't have the... Uh, need more gold chains. No, 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 no. Don't go off, don't go off, don't go off. Things AI is so quick through there, so I'm sort of surprised I didn't get the... What? Where is the Ford? Is that all the other Volvo, I should say? It's just disappeared. Also, I pressured him too much, and he's... he's He's cracked under the pressure, but we come over the line in eighth place. Celebrations. <laughs> oh, eighth is an awful, awful position, really. Look at it go. Look at us go. There's the highlights there. Oh, that is the other race that I didn't save. <laughs> this is just me crashing going through that corner and me going... <laughs> it's saved all my previous attempts. This isn't my first attempt. But there we are. Swag bent there. Eighth place. 29 seconds behind LM menu. We didn't do too well. We aren't going to race again, but I do have something special lined up, so uh, so stay tuned. Now you guys, you, you didn't think I forgot about this, did you? You didn't think I forgot about CM Garage. Cheat mode enabled. Cheat mode enabled. Thank you, Tiff. And that means we get or or de tank. Oh yes, <laughs> we're going to drive the tank at Donington. We're going to go back to Donington because I don't know, I can't drive Silverstone very well in this game. And uh, I'm going to show you the awesomeness that comes with the tank. Because this this is just this is just funny, this. If you haven't you never played Tokyo Touring Cars, you are in for a treat right now. This is uh, many hours of fun here, had by me and many others, I'm sure. So we're sitting on the grid of our tank and... Oh look, we've got a gun. So we're going to we're gonna get that gun going. Lights out, can't see where I'm going. Right, who's who's first? Who's the first victim? Who's it gonna be? Oh, someone's lost the, someone's lost the bonnet. Draw back a little bit. Oh, there they go! <laughs> you want me? <laughs> Junk colours, I fuck this shit. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> Crowd going wild, Derek Warwick again, fuck. Okay, where's Derek? 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 Mills has a present for you. Oh no, it's too far away. I can't see down the hill because of the uh, the lump, the, the camel hump at the top. Now the uh, the tank isn't the fastest, especially not around here. Oh, go go go! No, I'm gonna get him. No. All right, we're gonna catch him. We're gonna catch him, guys. We're gonna catch the fuckers. So as you can see at the back, obviously we've got our turbo working overtime there, turbo jet. Need some more power because unfortunately we aren't we aren't catching the guys in front. <laughs> I want to I want to initiate some more murder if possible. Right, so we've just caught the pack now, and uh, mayhem's going to ensue. I, I don't admit you guys want me to be driving fantastic to catch the pack. Here we go. And who's next? Oh, it's Derek. See you later, Derek. That's what you get for moaning so much. There you go. Music to the ears of every ginger in Salisbury. Ugh. Goodbye! <laughs> Is he still going? Oh no, he's out. He's finally out. Final lap! We need some more positions, don't we? What are you doing? There is no surviving. <laughs> See you later! <laughs> Someone just explode into the sky. The Volvo's terrified. I don't know why you're trying to, trying to muscle me out there, Mr. Volvo. I'm gonna... I'm gonna beat. I'm doing better. Than I did in the right. No, 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 no. The tank has its it has its downfalls. In that, it is actually a tank. I might have to cut again now till I catch these guys. Oh yes, I am. And we have cars in our sights again, ladies and gents. As we take the uh, the swag line, two more victims for the end of the race. Oh, just out of reach. Come on. I need more power. For the hairpin. Oh, no, 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 we're not going to catch him, we're not going to catch him. Come on, come on, tank. Show them, show them your power. <laughs> Get more coal in the back of that thing, come on. Yeah. Oh, he's got the Volvo. The Volvo's gone. He's whacked the Premier out of the way. The Volvo's still going. No, you don't, bitch. <laughs> Eighth 
face again! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love the tank. Look at that. The tank is great. Even even the logo is fantastic. Oh, that was great fun. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. That was fun to, that was fun to record and fun to play. Um, you can still get this game for like dirty cheap on eBay. So if you've got a PS1 lying around and you fancy a bit of a laugh, go and buy Tucker. Go celebrate his 18th birthday party and uh, buy a drink, why don't you? So thanks again for watching, guys. Have an awesome day and I'll catch you all next time. Take care.